Hey everybody, welcome to episode four. It's Adam, AKA The Real Sim. So we are back with our Digimon X playthrough. And in this episode, we have reached stage five. So we are starting to really make our way through that evolution line. We're about halfway through. We're gonna put these Digimon through the test. We're gonna make them fight each other and determine who in this episode will have the life of love, the life of luxury, and who's gonna have to survive. Now, don't forget everybody, this is a community hatch. So if you've got one of these devices, please go hatch a Digimon. You can email it to me or you can find me on Instagram. I'll put all of the links in the description down below. And I'll include you in a future video. Now once we get to ultimate or super ultimate we can have a big fight. If you've got an ACOM or a Wi-Fi com you can send me one of your codes and we'll duel it out. And for every video you participate in you're actually going to get an extra entry into the Asmaria giveaway that I'll be doing in a few weeks. Speaking of fights, let's take these three Digimon and make them duke it out and let's see who comes out on top for the life of love, the life of luxury, and let's see who's going to have to survive. Our Digimon evolved into some awesome Digimon. So we had our Ogremon X Digivolve into Mammothmon X, living that life of love. We had our Tyranimon X evolve into Chromon. And then for our final device, our XC, our Alamon X, he ended up evolving into Main Tyramon, which unfortunately this entire episode I mispronounced his name, but that's all right. All right, here we are getting ready for the tournament mode. And as always, we're gonna go ahead and open up a pack of Royal Knights. I have been trying to build my first deck with all the booster packs and a couple of beginner decks that I got and I cannot wait to go and play. I think I'm gonna try and go out this coming Wednesday night. So wish me luck. Let's see what we picked up. Geo Greymon, Galgamon, Bishop Chessmon, Porcupamon, Chumon, Sunflamon, Astamon, Richard Sampson, <laughs> what a, just normal guy. A key hero, Karada. I love that sometimes it's like, just some dude. Oh, check that out, Prince Mamimon. I really like the way that that card looks. Like it's seamless almost, no borders. I think that's really cool. Royal Knights of the Purge, check those guys out. We've got Omegamon, Gallimon, and Dukemon. Or no, that's Magnamon, how cool is that? Freaking awesome. And then last but not least, Ravemon. That's a cool card. In the heart of the chaos, Examon, one of the royal knights, fought valiantly against the relentless horde of ex-Digimon. But the unthinkable happened. He had been infected by the X program Even with his legendary resilience, the virus spread at an alarming speed, causing his entire body to writhe in agony. Examon's cries echoed across the battlefield as he struggled to maintain his composure. Above him, Lilithmon X, the deadly demon lord, hovered with an amused smirk. I grow bored of this. Allow me to put you out of your misery. <laughs> Just as all hope seemed lost, a powerful flame roared from the sky, interrupting Lilithmon X's attack. In a flash of gold, Phoenixmon X descended like a divine protector, spreading its majestic wings between Lilithmon X and the wounded Examon. The royal knights are a shining light in this world, a light that shall never be extinguished as long as hope remains. Though Phoenixmon X had stopped Lilithmon's assault with the element of surprise, facing one of the seven deadly Digimon in direct combat was a different story. The Demon Lord quickly regained her composure and overpowered Phoenixmon X, launching blow after blow. Blast! How can I call myself a protector if I can't win this? Examon looked upon Phoenixmon X's unwavering bravery. Despite being outmatched, Phoenixmon X stood tall, unwilling to back down. A surge of energy coursed through Examon's body. Thank you, Phoenixmon, for reminding me of our purpose. Let's finish this together. When they inspire me, I can't help but move into action. Side by side, Examon X and Phoenixmon X charged at Lilithmon X. Their powers united against the Demon Lord's hordes. With renewed vigor, they fought back, refusing to let the light of hope fade. In another corner of the war-torn old digital world, the situation was just as dire. With evil Digimon escaping the dark area, chaos spread like wildfire. Young Digimon, those too weak to fight, gathered in hidden corners, hoping to escape the destruction. Gatomon X, though brave, stood guard, struggling to ease their fears. It's okay. I'm sure you'll be safe here. Their hiding place was no longer a secret. From the shadows emerged Myotismon X, his presence alone causing the air to grow cold. With a flick of his hand, he shattered the protective walls the Digimon were hiding behind. 
Garamon X stood her ground, knowing she had to protect the helpless Digimon. She lunged forward with everything she had, but Myotis Mon X easily swatted her aside. No! I won't let you! As Myotis Mon X prepared to strike, an explosion rocked the battlefield from behind him. From the shadows appeared a new figure, cloaked in robes, eyes glowing with resolve. I am Wizardmon. I come from Witchily to defend the digital world and its people. If you wish to destroy this world, you'll have to go through me first. Inspired by Wizard Mon X's bravery, Gato Mon X knew she couldn't give up. A surge of power coursed through her, and in a flash of light, she digivolved into Angel Woman X, her angelic wings glowing with renewed strength. Together, we will protect those who cannot fight. This world still has hope. Elsewhere, the chaos spread even further. As Digimon fled for their lives, Mephistamon X pursued them relentlessly, his destructive power leaving nothing but ruin in his wake. All hope seemed lost until two new Digimon arrived, carried by the winds of justice. To save the weak and eradicate evil, Justamon, the righteous Digimon, has arrived. Uh, I'm Ciceramon. Just get on with it. Justamon X, ever the dramatic hero, struck a pose as explosions went off behind him. But there was no time to waste. Ciceramon X rushed forward, attacking Mephistamon X directly. From the new digital world, are you? Interesting, but you'll find I'm not so easily defeated. Despite the odds, Justamon X and Ciceramon X worked together to defeat the powerful Mephistamon X. Their valor inspired the Digimon that had once fled in fear, who now rallied together to join the fight. That's right. We can't rely on the Royal Knights for everything. It's up to all of us to protect our world. Dynasmon X found himself outnumbered and struggling to hold off two of the most powerful Digimon from the Dark Area, Afanimon Chaos Mode and Cherubimon X. With the battle intensifying, hope seemed distant. Until help arrived. We've come to aid you, Sacred Knight. You will not fight alone. The reinforcements were none other than Afanimon X and Cherubimon X Light, two of the three great angels. They stepped forward, prepared for a true mirror match against their dark counterparts. You have my thanks. With you here, I'll join Magnamon X and finish off Beelzebon X. You've had the advantage long enough, Beelzebon. Let's see how you fare when it's two against one. <laughs> Bring it on! I was getting bored with just Magnamon. Let's see what you've got! It wasn't just the Royal Knights arriving to assist in the battle. Digimon from the new digital world began to appear across the land as if summoned by fate itself. These brave warriors nearly pushed to their limits stood tall, ready to fight for peace and restore balance to the digital world. As battles raged in every corner of the digital world, Lusamon X, ever the schemer, slipped away from the chaos and returned to the deepest, darkest depths of the dark area. There, in the shadowy silence, a sinister figure awaited him, Karamon X, unmoving, staring into the void. The plan has entered its final stages. <laughs> What was Lusamon X plotting? As the digital world teetered on the edge of destruction, the Demon Lord moved to cast an even darker shadow, one that could engulf the entire world. Across the old digital world, the once separate gates to the dark area merged into a single colossal gate, releasing an endless swarm of evil Digimon. The skies darkened as the last days of the digital world seemed inevitable. But just as the digital world faced certain doom, voices rang out from the heavens. Don't, Don't give up, up. We're, we're here to help. help. It was Kota and Yuji, the legendary heroes who once helped secure the future of the X antibody. Alongside them were Omega Mon X and Alpha Mon, charging into battle with their overwhelming power. For the future of the digital world, we will not fall. With Kota, Yuji, and their army leading the charge, the light of hope had returned. The battle between light and darkness was about to begin in earnest. It's time for all of your all's Digimon to make an appearance, and first up we've got none other than my buddy Wario Digimon. My Cherubimon is gonna kick butt. This metal Piranimon is stinky. Stinky and goopy and sloppy and sticky. Sick em, boy, sick em. Next up we've got Digimon Q8 on Instagram with a Sakuyamon. And then we've got my buddy Tai Hakai with, with a Diaboramon X, and my friend Tama Moth. On Instagram, check out the Leomon X and Metal Greymon X, and a special appearance from Nino the Incredible, representing that Leomon X. And then our pal Johan had his Gabumon X evolve into Tobu Katmon, into Chromon, and then into Platinum Numamon, and I believe they're going to attempt to get Omegamon X, so good luck, wish you the best, I know that's quite a feat. Next up we have Marsu's Tamers on Instagram with a Belfomon X, and check out that awesome doggo in the background. 
And last but not least, my buddy Connor has made it all the way to Black War Greymon. You are the champion, man. That is so awesome. I'm, I'm so happy that everyone is having so much fun with this hatch. You all keep hatching, and if you want to get in on the game, you know how. All right, here we go for the tournament mode. So I've got Chromon on our XA, I have got Mammothmon on our XD, and I have got Mimi Tyranomon on our XC. So we've got some awesome Digimon here to put against each other. And as we did last time, we're going to do two out of three, and we will just do one round in this episode. We're going to keep it nice and short. So let's go ahead and battle off our Chromon versus our Mimi Tyranomon. Now I have gotten both of them up to level four, all three of these actually. And again, whichever one has the lower Zyro will initiate. Nice, maybe Tyranomon pulling out a win. All right, here we go, round two. He might come out on top. Here we go. Nice. Maybe Tyranomon taking Chromon down. So we've got one point for Maybe Tyranomon, zero points for Chromon. Let's go ahead and pit our Maybe Tyranomon versus Mammothmon. Nice dodge, Mammothmon. Mega hits. Dang, Mammothmon. He's wanting to keep that life of love, I'm telling you. Round two. Man, Mammothmon dodging. All right, so Mammothmon, one point. Mammy Tyranomon, one point. And Chromon, zero points. So now we gotta do Mammothmon versus Chromon. Nice, Mammothmon taking Chromon down. Let's get into round two. Round two, here we go. Can Chromon pull out another win or is Mammothmon gonna take it home in first place? Mammothmon is doing everything he can to keep that life of love. Chromon might be losing that life of luxury. Nice dodge, Mammothmon. Here we go, this might determine it. Dang, it does. Chromon didn't stand a chance, and Mammothmon stomped him down. So we are gonna have, Mammothmon is going to continue living that life of love, no care mistakes, nice training, and we're gonna be putting him through that tournament mode pretty heavily. Our XC device has taken the life of luxury, so we're going to get him nice and healed up. He will not get any care mistakes, and he will not have to train anymore, and he will not have to go through the tournament area anymore. We're going to keep him just nice, fat, and happy. And then on our survive, our XA or our Chromon, he's going to have to survive. So he's going to be getting lots of care mistakes, and I'll definitely be forcing him through the tournament. There you have it folks, Mammothmon has decided to choose the life of love. And Mammy Tyranomon actually got up into that life of luxury. Chromon on the other hand is gonna have to survive. 
I really hope you're enjoying today's adventure. I know I had an absolute blast. And if this is your first episode, then you need to go back to episode one and check out all the cool lore, check out all the antics we've gotten up to. And if you have a Digimon X device and you want to hatch along with me, feel free to. It's not too late. Go ahead and send me an email at therealsimzo at gmail.com or find me on Instagram at therealsimzo. And you can send in your pictures. Just introduce yourself and your Digimon. If you have an ACOM or a Wi-Fi com, you're welcome to send me a code and we'll duke it out whenever we get to that stage. But otherwise, if you enjoyed today's episode, please leave me a like and a subscribe and take care of yourselves and we'll see you next time.